everybody and welcome on back to another glorious video here on the Spoiler Review channel and tonight we're going to be doing another movie review and no it is not a review on my poll on my community spot because I'm still holding off on doing that one until November the 30th uh, so until then we're going to be doing another one uh, The Terminator from Arnold Schwarzenegger which I did do Terminator 2, Judgment Day, I think it was on my other channel, but I can't remember off the top of my head, uh, I might have to either double check or something around that, and then if it is on that channel, then I'll put a link to it in the description down below, um, and then you guys can watch that one on there, and then, uh, I guess go from there. Uh, so, yeah. So, anyway, this movie was by far the best action movie that I've ever seen and reviewed. By far. Because Arnold Schwarzenegger, really good actor. Re he just really. He did awesome. That's all I'm going to say on it. And, um, anyway, uh, the. DVD did come with a picture of Arnold Schwarzenegger, uh, so hopefully I can freaking uh, try and show you guys the picture real quick. Hopefully this time I don't let me turn off my phone. So anyway, there's the picture. I've got it taped up on my wall right now, so yeah, there's that. And oh. yeah, it did come up with a little picture with Arnold Schwarzenegger and stuff, so I taped it up on my wall. And then, of course, here's the case with Arnold Schwarzenegger holding the pistol and with the sunglasses and everything, which he kind of looks awesome. And here's the back of the bio, if you guys want to try and pause the video and read that. I don't know if you'll be able to see it with the thing, but there's that. Because I actually got this movie from my grandparents from or for Thanksgiving. I kind of because they let me go through some of their old movies and I managed to find a couple good ones uh, that I didn't have so I thought might as well just do one of them for now and then I will be doing a review of some of the other Terminator movies I got uh, Terminator 3 and Terminator uh, Salvation so I will be doing reviews on those because I did already do uh, Terminator 2 Judgment Day, which I'm pretty sure is on my old channel with my old account, but I just, blah. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, there's that. And of course, the, kit, the DVD itself just has a picture of Arnold Schwarzenegger holding the pistol like on the front of the case, so there's that. Um, and of course, this movie was made in 1984, so for it being a 1984 movie, that was crazy. I mean, the first time I saw it, I was like, because I kept thinking that the Terminator robot was dead, because there was so many times where I thought he was dead, but then all of a sudden he just kept popping up and popping up and popping up, and I'm like, wow, can that thing just not die? Because he was, like, really determined to kill the other main characters. I mean, he was really determined. <laughs> it, it was just crazy. I mean, then again, it's only it was only the first Terminator movie, and I'm like, wow. And I've not really seen Arnold Schwarzenegger in a lot of stuff, 
because I've seen him in the Terminator films. Well, now I've seen him in the Terminator films, and I've seen him in Batman and Robin as Mr. Freeze, and I've seen him in another movie. I can't remember what I want. Another one I saw him in, but I do remember him in some stuff. Other than the Terminator stuff. But, um, it, it was just nuts. Seeing him do all the stuff that he did and just, whew, it was mind-blowing. Because it always had me on the edge of my seat. It had me thinking that the Terminator was dead, but then he kept coming back and back and back and back. And just, whoo, kind of took me back to my uh, roots on the Michael Bay Transformers movies, almost. Where there were, like, tons of explosions and all that type of stuff. And just, oh boy. Yeah, so. This movie, by far, the best movie I've seen, so if you're a huge action movie collector like I am, I would definitely recommend you try to pick this up. I don't know if you can pick it up on Blu-ray now or not, but I'm pretty sure you can pick it up on DVD still. Uh, I got it from my grandparents as like a hand-me-down, but it's still, it's still a good movie. <laughs> For it being 1984, so yeah, that's gonna be yeah, that's gonna be it for this movie review. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. And I will catch you guys in the next one. And also, when you subscribe, don't forget to ring that bell to get notified on whenever I do upload. And I guess I will see you guys again on the 30th when I do the um, I'm guessing maybe King Kong movie review because the last time I checked my poll I only got the one vote so I'm guessing I'm going to be doing King Kong on the 30th so I guess be on the lookout for that um it will be going up it'll probably be going up uh next month or near the beginning of next month because I, yeah, I, I, I just don't know. So, so the Terminator movie review and the King Kong movie review will be recorded for this month, but they'll probably be going up next month uh, due to uh, certain stuff. Because I'm pretty busy trying to keep track of my apartment and everything to make sure I don't get too, get too distracted with different things and make sure I don't screw everything up and <laughs> manage getting my kick, getting myself kicked out. So yeah, I'll be busy taking care of some stuff and I'll post it whenever I can next month and, uh, yeah, this is Special Beetle signing off, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace. I'm out.